a little bit right here. What up, players? All right, so today's video is pretty much just gonna be um, just like an update, kind of update slash working on cars. Um, gotta do some do some stuff to Nova and show you what's been going on with it. And I'm opening the gate for the schmuck. The C10 just died, actually. Okay, so I'm gonna be doing some shit to the Nova. Uh, show you what Camaro is looking a little different. Maybe we'll talk about this shit later. And uh, my truck too. I've done some stuff, some stuff so I can talk to you guys about it. But uh, yeah, we'll just get to it. <laughs> So, just another day in the office. You guys already know we're working with broken shit here. So, I have some clips of me and my brother were working on this shit. We took the engine up. At the oil pan. That's the oil pan. And there's a put the new oil pan. Well, it wasn't a new oil pan. I got my old one that was cracked. I put a my friend E.G. Buck on Instagram. He welded it all up, so I was able to use the same one. So I put that back in, and then I put a new tranny pan because that one was cracked too. So now what we're gonna be working with is this here. Turns out I've broke more than just my oil pan and my fucking frame cracked right here. So I'm gonna try to take off. I'm gonna take my wheel off, take the arm off maybe, and fucking see if I could get it down back in place and weld this shit back up. And also what took some damage was this right here. My sway bar link from my, this right tech shit even broke, dude, look. So that shit broke. All kinds of fucking, look at this ghetto shit I had to do. So we're gonna be hopefully getting some of this shit done. Hopefully getting the whole thing done today. Unless depends on how fucking mad I get working on this shit. But yeah, there's pretty much Nova's just been sitting here collecting more dust. Just sitting, you know? Then we have this, like um He's got Dakota digital gauges. I don't know if you... Oh, shit. This is going to He's got Dakota Digital Gauges, and um, I burnt the little... Because they run off a separate little, like, computer, kind of. And I accidentally burnt the computer a couple days... Well, not a couple days ago, like a week ago, or two weeks ago now. And I we were waiting for a new box to come in. That's why he hasn't been driving it, but he's also painted all the window trim black. The bumper, this is all just spray can temporary. Same with mine, I did all mine too. They're all black, some more. Then he did his bumpers and the bezels and everything. So that's pretty much what's been going on with this one. And this is, it. This is my truck, this is my daily truck. The engine and Chinese took a shit on me like last year and I just had it sitting there. And I ended up coming up on a Tahoe like couple a little newer than that one than my truck and i ended up taking out the engine tranny just swapped them in there and i've been having it running already for like a couple weeks and pretty much no issues so far 
completely just swapped the engine and tranny so that's pretty much what we've been up to and once this once the c10 gets back here i'll show you guys a couple things my other brother's been doing to it so the c10's back and i just want to show you guys one quick little thing he's been working on so here's this cool uh he's gonna be putting like one of those tv screen radios just in well he had to weld this panel in and he's in the process of finishing it he just that's got to do some light body work to it and yeah it will be finished up and nice once he puts the tv screen in there well it's not gonna be a t it's a radio i don't know what do you call those but a fucking radio and yeah my other brother who doesn't live with us bad bird been getting some stuff done on his car too he got his new wheels finally i'll put a picture up so you guys can see it and just more progress you know from all of us getting stuff done in these times we're all kind of just stuck at home but yeah we're making the best out of it getting shit done still Now you guys can get a little better view of what exactly happened here. So this is not supposed to be a gap right there. I'm gonna say two things, okay? Let me see, say some. What does a burrito? turns into, what does it turn into from a burrito? What? A chicken! So, got the coil over loose, just sitting in there now. Um, what I'm gonna do now is disconnect the ball joint right here, this castle nut, take this shit off. Hopefully it comes out easy without messing up the ball joint. Grinded this shit, oh, fuck. I already grinded this shit down a little bit right here. Up a little bit better, there's still some of the fucking black on the inside. So, this little, fucking tab welded on here just so I can use my clamp. Let's see if I could do this shit. Pretty much it's supposed to go like that. There you go. That way it holds it in place so it doesn't slide off. And with this. What's up, dude? All right, have, this is what I got. Close the gap. Now I'm gonna just do it. Pretty much a fucking fat ass weld all the way across, melt it all together. But my brother told me that we should heat it, like preheat it. So he's gonna go get the torch and we're just gonna fucking heat this shit up. Finished pretty much welding up. I think I'm done. Oh, let's get the brush. Okay, that should be 
good, I think. I don't think it would go anywhere with all that weld. So yeah, now it's just fucking, I guess I could let it cool off for a little bit so I could paint it, throw some paint over it so it doesn't rust too bad, but yeah, fucking put that back together. Then it should be done. All right, so I didn't end up recording the rest of me working because it was pretty much what I showed you guys already, but just working backwards, I guess, when I put it back together. So here's how it came back out. I don't think you could see can't really see shit from the inside, from outside, I mean, but. Yeah, here it's sitting back. Normal, hopefully it didn't throw off my alignment. Probably did a little bit, but. The other side, like I said, is cracked. I don't know if I said it in the other videos, but this side's cracked too, so I'm not, it's not fully open like the other side was, but there's a little crack, like. So I wanna clean that side up and re-weld it too, just so everything is done right. Mm -hmm.